Hey guys, and welcome back to Fatal Frame. Uh, so, in the last episode, our sister got locked up. Unfortunately, uh, we moved up to Chapter 5. And we've got the hammer key, so we can finally uh, get out of this room. And hopefully back into the main village. And we need to go find a key to help our sister. So, the flashlight came on. But it wouldn't come on in the house. Yeah, interesting. So there's some kind of block, spiritual block, that's stopping the camera from, oh, the camera, the uh, flashlight for working in that house. Interesting. Okay. So I know we've just saved it, but we're going to save it again, because that's what we're going to do. So says I. <clears throat> Not sure why this game <laughs> takes so long to save. It's almost comical but whatever whatever right let's go now we need to have a little look at our map don't we because right so we need to go to the Osaka house okay so which one was the Osaka house Because there was there was one door that was locked. I remember that much. It's possible it's a house that we've already been in. I can't actually remember all of the names. Oh, actually, what we could do let's have a little listen to Radio Mayu. So Itsuki was the one that was helping us, the outsider, and I guess had to be sacrificed because we ran away. It's uh, yeah, it's a pretty rough tale, to be honest. Now let's take a gander at the map. Oh, we don't know. Kiru House. Ah. That's your Osaka house. Yeah, so that's the house that we were in in the beginning of the game. The first place. Oh, should we go back and see if we can do anything with that tree? Oh. Yeah, we're not going to get a shot at that ghost, are we? Oh, yes, we are. Corridor woman. Oh, does that mean that corridor is now open? Uh, should we have a look? But I kind of want to go. There's so much I want to do. Right, that corridor might be open now. But let's go back and see if we can examine that tree. Because it mentioned something about a wooden door. Uh, a wooden door. A wooden key. Ooh. Lord woman. Interesting. We've got f sod all points for that. Okay. Well, let's do one thing at a time. So. Running away. Storehouse bound. Why are we getting so few points for these? Right, so. Sh oh, God. So many things. We've got to check the storehouse, which I'm. Yes, so that's the house that we've got to go into. Let's get all the way out of here, go back up to the tree. Then we'll check the storehouse. Then we'll go into that other house and see if that passageway is open now. Man, I don't actually know if uh, that's what's going to happen. I don't know if we're going to be able to, but we shall have a little look around. I suppose we might as well, now we're finally uh, allowed to escape. A little bit of freedom. Unfortunately, Mayu is uh, trapped in that uh, 
delightful room whilst we're out exploring the village trying to find a key now this could have been just like a throwaway thing that was just mentioned but I kinda doubt it interesting that it kind of fades out and becomes very black and white as we come up here okay Roots of the dry tree, there's a hole. Pistol. Okay, so it's, we still hmm, still can't do any. Even though that we've read that it's a hollowed out uh, area, we still can't do anything there. Oh. Who is coming? You are. Hey, friend. Right, let's deal with this chap. I suppose it was worth it coming up here for the XP. Not so sure about the drain on our resources. I suppose we've got plenty of film for now. Come on, big boy. There we go. One more. Potentially use a blast back on him, but yeah. No, oh, that didn't work. There we go. Can we get a fatal frame on him? No. Apparently not. Interesting. Maybe. Maybe some ghosts don't have fatal frames. Is that a thing? That might be a thing. I mean, we've got a lot of health anyway, I suppose. Not happy that I had to use some health on him, but... Whatever. Anyway, well, we came back, and we got some XP. We're going to want to upgrade our camera to the best of our ability. Although, you don't seem to get huge increases. I mean, I'm sure it makes some amount of difference. I'm guessing if you compare like a basic level camera to a leveled out, a completely maxed out camera, there probably would be a decent chunk of difference. It's just hard to notice through the incremental upgrades. So I think we're going to hit up the storehouse next. Because if that woman was going towards it, generally, if you see a ghost going through a locked door, that means the door's open now. So we're going to run with that logic. And we'll be back to see this house later. Because I'm not sure if there's like actual missable stuff. Oh. Yeah, it's such a pitiful amount of points. Oh, Butterfly Diary 4. Yi, why did you leave by yourself? It's our fault that this is happening to Itsuki. You promised we'd always be together. Mm. And some fluoride. Well, at least the fluoride has a use in this game. Fluorite. Interesting. Yeah, so I'm guessing the two twins disappeared and they were never found. I'm not sure. Ah, oh, so it's still locked. Okay, well, is there anything new happening behind here? I wonder if um, Itzuki. Ah, Itzuki. 
possibly still here. The cell key. I think they keep it at the Osaka house. Break the pinwheel seal to get to the basement of that house. Search the family altar. It has some kind of mechanism. Make all four sections of the pinwheel the same color. Then it'll open, open the up. underground. We can get out. Ha. Huh. I do like the fact that he's there helping us. And the crimson butterflies floating around as well. All right. So, yeah, I know, I know, I know. I know we need to go to the Yasaka house, I know, but I want to check the other house out first. See if anything new's happened there. I mean, probably, I don't know. As I say, probably not, but I'm, I'm sort of hopeful something new's happened. Sort of hopeful. <clears throat> Because they made a... Ooh. Crying girl. Nice. That was a good... How many points have we got now for our camera? But a lot, apparently. We've got enough to upgrade blast. Or do we want to upgrade range? Accumulation doesn't seem to be massively useful. Yeah, let's go for that. Oh, wrong thing. That only costs 30,000. Which isn't actually that expensive. Okay, that's fine. I'm not really 100% sure what to prioritize on the upgrades, but I always assume prioritizing damage is a good thing. Yeah, we can't go in there. Now, what is through this house? There might be like, there might be another reel of film or something in here. Which was through that door. I don't know if like more items will repopulate as we go on. Because there was a locked door in here as well. No, that's still dead. And that's still locked. Okay. I'm still really gutted that we couldn't go in that other room. The room where we had to open the two pressure plates. Should have gone further in. But, uh, never mind. Okay. Now, are you open now? No. God damn it. So it literally shows us a ghost going through there. Like, obviously. And it's locked. Waste of time. I don't suppose there's any point in searching anywhere else. Not in here, anyway. Right, to the Osaka house. All right, <laughs> I'm really disappointed. I literally thought that door would be open. So, I guess we know for next time. This game is um, very linear, actually. Kind of gives you that feeling that you can explore this village, but you really can't. I mean, that's not a bad thing. That's not a criticism. This game doesn't need to be um, open. In fact, it would probably hurt it, to be honest. But it's just its kind of strange. Right, let's go in and find our key. Okay, well, it's been a while. Do we have any ghosties in here? We don't. Right, now, let's have a little look on the map. So... What we're looking for was over here. Family altar room. Apparently there was a... Oh, wait. Hang on. Uh, do we want to go 
save it. I think we'll go save it up here because well, my my ghosty senses are tingling. At least if we've made a save in this room or in this house, we know we're safe then. So if anything screws up, it's not. Uh, we don't have to go too far back. <clears throat> right. Okay, so what we're looking for, if I remember correctly from having a squiz at that map, was just down here. It wasn't there, was it? Oh, paper lamp. Doesn't seem to be anything special in the closet. Okay. Uh, family altar room. Oh, that was this one, wasn't it? The one with the dead body in. Yeah, family altar room. Okay. Ah. Type zero film. Okay. Yeah, that's quite nice. Uh, hmm. So I guess there is more items to explore and find in here now. Does that warrant a complete look around? Oh. Five pinwall stone tablets in the small door behind the family altar. An unlocking device. Oh. It's going to be one of these. Ah, right. So you can only push it X amount of times. It's like five times. Turns four. I see. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. That was close. Alright. So maybe... Turn that, that, that. That? No. It's going to be another one of those situations where we're just going to have to fiddle. Again, close. One out. Uh, let's just try. Hey! Wait, no. God damn it. Just need to turn it once more. There we go. Cool. There are mortuary tablets and incense burners. Okay, what could have happened here? I don't know. What has opened? Hmm. It said something's opened behind the altar. Does it literally mean in the room? in the corridor behind. Maybe. I mean, I'm not really sure whether... what would technically be behind. Ooh. Yeah, she's literally still just standing there chilling out. Ooh, alarm. 
when this function is equipped, it sounds a tone to warn you of the exact fate. Oh, interesting. So she's literally still just chilling here. That's really strange. I don't know why she's just standing here muttering to herself. Like every time we come into this area. Like, there, surely there has to be something that we can do with her. But... No? Okay. Alright, well, whatever. Alright, what did that actual map say? That we picked up? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So is it, it has to be in that room then, surely. But I tried examining everything, and it even gave us a poor description of something, or it did nothing. Strange. Definitely want to look at the rest of the house as well. See if there's any other goodies stashed. Let's have a look upstairs. I'm very surprised thus far there's been no ghosts. Oh. Oh. Peeking kid. Yeah, so it is worth exploring. Okay, so we've got another lens. Not convinced that's that useful, but sure. Okay. That kind of looks like a door there, but I mean, obviously not. I hope our sister's okay. Ooh. 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 Nice. Come to me. You guys are literally just experience. Waiting to be consumed. Not a bad amount of experience either for that matter. Yeah, we're not getting a huge amount here. That's okay. Double shot, very happy with that. Come on, Sunny Jim. I'll hit one of them. Yeah, this is gonna come down to the wire. Nice. Hey, double kill. Oof, that did get a little bit hairy there for a minute. You guys gonna drop anything for me? No. Yeah, that did actually get pretty pretty intense there for a second. Alright, whatever. Hmm. So there's still another room to check. Yeah, I I wasn't sure. I kind of was expecting to not find a lot at all. But, hey. Happy to find some items. Always happy to find some items. I guess there's nothing in this one, though. Alright. Okay, sure, fine. Oh. Are you serious? Can we... Man, there's literally like, there's no consistency in this game. Like, is that really not a... Okay, well, apparently not. Alright. It's just... 
bit of bait to make you waste your uh, film, I suppose. Right, so we've explored the house anyway. We found some goodies. But where the hell is the key? We've opened the puzzle, but I... At least I thought I thoroughly examined the puzzle area, but... It didn't give us an option to pick anything up. So I, I guess I must have missed it. <clears throat> I mean, that looks like a door. Have we just got the key in our inventory now? No? Um... I'm very confused with this. Because there's an audible click. But there's nothing there. Um... Right, one second guys, let me look this up because <laughs> there's nothing here even though we've completed a puzzle. Oh, right. It now seems to have unlocked. Now part of the wall can be slid to one side. Um, I examined... <laughs> well, you guys all saw me examining this. I don't know why. I literally just had to get a guide and look it up. Because I've been running around this house for ages and I've just saved it and all that lots. Run around, look around. Nope, it's this panel here that I searched 50,000 times. Okay. So, there are mysteries in this house. Ooh. Ooh. Is that the folklorist? Ooh. There's something going on down here. Oh, so there's a stone mirror. Interesting. There are old suits of armor and Buddha statues here. This place must have been used for storage. Ooh. So you found some prionite. Let's give that a listen. That's got to be pretty terrifying to be like a spirit that's just lost. Right, so there's a stone mi- ooh, nice. I don't actually think we needed that. Potentially just wasted. Ooh. You can see a large space beyond the rocks. This underground passage must lead somewhere else too. Yeah, I guess so. Film reel 7. Probably be viewed with a projector. Well, we know where there's a projector. So, okay. Right. So, we found some cool stuff. Can we climb through? Uh, you can see a large space beyond the rocks. This underground passage must lead somewhere else, too. Right. But you don't want to. Is that it? Um, okay. Hmm. Oh. Again, I searched this like six or seven times. <laughs> sure, okay. Very inconsistent.
empty. Ooh, this is going to be a boss, isn't it? So that's got to be a mourner, one of the guys with his uh, eyes taped shut. Oh, well that was lucky. Yeah, fucked up, girl. Right. Let's give him a bit of the old freeze juice. And then hit him with that. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, God. So this guy goes into, like, a combo of attacks. Is that, like, a straight four combo? Kind of interesting. Oh, come on. Oh no, we actually hurt him. Curious. Nice zero shot. Oh, shit. Oh, he can just... Right, so he's literally just... Can we move? Is that okay? So he literally just gives us four attacks in one go, and you can't appear to avoid them. <laughs> okay. Because although we're just standing there... Um, I guess to be fair, like even if he killed us, we could have just used the stone mirror and it would have been fine. Uh, okay, not mm, right. Not really sure what to think about that, but in fact, I would have rather died and used the stone mirror if there's literally another one there that we could grab. So anyway, we've got the key to go get our sister freed. Interesting, he wasn't actually that strong. He was uh, just a bit of a dick penis man. Oh. Can I... Are we like... Are we fighting her now? Yeah, I guess so. Where are you? Show yourself. There you are. Right, let's take her out. Ah, this is quite cool because she's kind of been inhabiting this room for ages. Or this, like, house for ages. And now we can actually fight her. That's a kind of cool little build up bit of tension with her. Can we wait for a zero shot? Nah, not gonna risk it. Not gonna risk it. Don't know if she's gonna have one of those. Not sure if she's gonna have one of those um, zero shots that seem to go off with about four seconds or four milliseconds to actually take the shot. That's fine. We've got plenty of film. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Come on, love. Ooh. She really snuck up on us there, didn't she? Now, where are you? Where? Where? Are oh, there you are. Come on. Let's be having ya. Ooh. Oh shit, got a bit of a wiggle on then. Someone's had their monster this morning. Nice, finished her off. Right. Did she drop anything though? Kind of get a f the feeling. Actually, if we go into our photos.
Can we not? Oh, she's just a wanderer. Oh. Okay, I thought she was actually going to be... Is she still over here in this room, though? I thought she was going to be, like, an actual named ghost. I guess not, though. That's not where we want to go. Very curious to see if she's still here. Or if she's dropped a crystal somewhere, which could be anywhere, let's be fair. No, she's still there. Ha. Huh. Well, hell if I know. I just live here. Okay, right. So what we're going to do, we're going to go hit up the save point, guys. And then we're going to call it a video. And as much as I want to just sit here and continue playing this, uh, i got to start thinking about getting ready for work tomorrow. Yay. But I certainly am looking forward to coming back to this on my days off. Although I'm not like a huge fan of the combat, everything else about the game is really interesting. Like, you know, the stories and stuff. And just the overall atmosphere. It has to be said, this game does have a very unique atmosphere. So, anyway guys, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. And when we come back, well, we're going to go and, I guess, free our sister. And then I assume we're going to go through that double um, pressure plate door. So, till then guys, thanks for watching.